Biasen is a leading provider of metal to metal downhole sealing technology. The traditional problems that we've used in bismuth based alloys downhole is uh, the ability to melt it and uh, everybody that's tried it before us has been using electrical heat and there's lots of advantages of, of electrical heat. You can turn it up, you can turn it down, you can increase the amount of heat that's being generated. Unfortunately it takes an awful lot of power down the, the wire line to produce that heat and we've been experimenting with using thermite and we could just see the reduction in time from six hours to melt the alloy to literally a couple of minutes. The bismuth alloy is quite unique with some of the properties. It expands on solidification very similar to water when it changes to ice. We get a 3% expansion and we use that expansion downhole to create a gas tight seal. One of the other properties is it's also got viscosity very similar to water which is very useful, especially if you're trying to seal off, say, through sunscreen, where we can get it to flow through a 200 micron sunscreen. It's also very corrosion resistant, and we've tested it in downhole environments up to 3,000 years uh, for corrosion resistance. It's also very dense. It's very similar to lead. It's got an SG of 10, and we use that density to get it to flow out into, say, perforations or into an open hole gravel pack. We use the alloy in different applications and we transport it downhole in, in different ways. Sometimes we'll have it cast on the outside of the tool. Uh, other times we would use it in shot form or a little BB shot. Other times, say if it's a completion tool, we'll place the alloy on the outside of the inner string, just like donuts, they're then cemented in place. And we run inside the well bore with a heater afterwards and melt the alloy once it's all in situ. We've been working with BP now for two and a half years, as well as providing equity funds. It's really the expertise and support that they provide. Their engineers seem to pick up and understand the base technology and how it could be applied to different applications. This has really helped the ISN develop a number of tools and solutions which BP are now applying in the field. We did a job on a, on a P&A where the rig time was estimated to be 10 days and after running one of our tools that was reduced down to one day. So a considerable saving for BP. Being associated with BP has been very helpful, especially when it comes to other customers and uh, a lot of the operators look up to BP as one of the leaders in innovation and if it's good enough for BP then it's good enough for us.